we was very poor. We was living in, in Dominican Republic. When I turned 15, my dad bring us here to United States, Kansas City, Missouri. Uh, it was strange because we was in a different place. I don't know, no English. <laughs> I graduated from high school. Then I left my dad's house because I was, uh, because in my culture it's not good to have a boyfriend at the age of 17. It's like my dad was very jealous, so I left my house and I lived with my boyfriend. And then I was working and going to college. We went through the hospital. The doctor said that I was pregnant. And that relationship was horrible because he don't want me or he wasn't want the baby and he was having another girlfriend without me knowing. Then we break up. I was feeling alone and scared. My family don't want to know about abortion and nothing else, so I lied to them because it was being a difficult pregnancy. I get so scared. A friend told me about playing parenthood. Well, they treat like people like they don't care and they don't tell you nothing. They don't show you nothing. They give me a pill over there and then they give me another pill that I had to take in the night. I take the pill in the night and uh, I was feeling like curious about how many weeks I have in. The doctor said that I have like seven weeks and then I looked it up in Google it was a whole body of the baby already in there. And I was crying, then I went to my mom in the morning that I feel bad because I drink this pill, I don't want the baby to die. And then I called FSNA for they to help me. I was feeling that some people care about what I was going through. They was telling me that I have another option they hold me with another pill for I can drink it for the baby to be normal, to be good. Three months later, I went to my regular appointment to the hospital, and they told me that the baby looks good and looks fine. I was feeling very happy. When the baby um, come and I see her she was good and healthy she don't come on that crying she come on with smiling <laughs> I had a picture and and all what I did it was gonna be wrong and thanks to God <laughs> she's here now and and I know one day she's gonna be somebody everything she went through. I know I did the right thing. And I'm thankful to God and to everybody who was there.